Welcome back in 654 right now. Let's check back in with WMR2 News is Mark Roper out at Six Flags America to find out whether he was able to handle Harley Quinn's spin sanity. So Mark, how was the ride? Well, Christian, you know, I've been on 250 roller coasters all across the country. I've been on roller coasters that are 400 feet tall that go 92 miles an hour. And I think I finally met my match. I mean, after riding this ride, <laughs> I think about halfway through, I was ready to get off. <laughs> so <laughs> I think you're going to have to join me next time and, and see if you can handle this as well. It's the spinning part of it that gets me. I can do the up and down part, uh, but the spinning is going to be tough, especially if I've just eaten something like a nice funnel cake there <laughs> at Six Flags America. Yeah, I'm glad, I'm glad I didn't eat anything this morning. <laughs> a but, wise, you know, a wise you, move. I'm not a coffee drinker. This ride would definitely wake you up in the morning, that's for sure. Okay, that could be our new plan for the reporters. Send them down to Six Flags America first, get them all woken up, ready to go for Good Morning Maryland. Uh, yeah, I'm glad you enjoyed at least so much. Yeah, it, it, it was fun. We rode it the first time and we heard that uh, they might have to take us again because I don't know if you guys saw us ride the whole ride during our, our last hit. And they told me that we might have to do it again. <laughs> At that point, I was like, I don't know if I would be able to handle it again. <laughs> so there's another ride here called Superman. I could ride that 10 times in a row. This ride, uh, I think for me, once was enough. So this will be definitely the ride for thrill seekers. And they'll find out once it opens tomorrow who else is ready to challenge Harley Quinn's Sanity?